before we moved in, this was the parking lot for Domino Sugar Factory. And it was this vacant lot, kids would break in, run around, it was unused for a long period of time. It was apparently before that a big foundation for a massive building. Two Trees bought it and they gave us the opportunity to build a mountain bike park and a BMX park for, for a year. And we jumped on the opportunity. bring passive and active recreation to the community and establishing volunteer ethics, social connectivity and environmental awareness and physical activity. That's what it really does. There's also going to be like a public plaza. There's going to be food vendors. We have a little farm, reading room, a bit of yoga. It's a wide range. The pump tracks are progressive. The advanced pump track has a lot of features in it. It's a signature of mine. It's um, one of the best designs I've ever created so far. A lot of connectivity. There's actually three pump tracks built into the one main pump track. Rollers, 360 berms, J turns, S turns, pocket berms. Those are all features that you have to deal with and learn about when you go in there. As a former freestyler and still active in the sport, it has a lot of little ninja lines and creativity where if you are a freestyle, you will really appreciate the advanced pump track. All right, we're here with Chris Trombley. He's going to tell us how it works. How does it work? We're looking at uh, probably a seven day a week operation coming up in the next couple months. We're just getting started out here, so we're really looking to be open only Thursday through Sunday from 10 to 6 in the interim until we start to get things going here a little bit more. We're going to have bikes available on site for rent, so if you don't have your own bike and you want to learn how to ride the pump track and the awesome features that we have here, we're going to have bikes of all sizes from little 12 inch kids bikes all the way up to full size 26 inch mountain bikes. So. If you're under 16, it's going to be free. There'll be no charge. You just got to fill out a waiver. Uh, we'll have helmets available for rent as well. All right, so how can people find out what's happening here at the park? Oh, well, you can just check them out on Brooklyn Bike Park on Facebook or brooklynbikepark.org. We had a special surprise visit from NYC legend Ed Wonka here at the Pump Track. Ed, what'd you think? I thought it was great. Uh, I love that New York is popping up with a bunch of skate parks. This pump track, you know, there's plenty of places for extreme sports to go down and, you know, kids to have fun. What was it like to ride this thing on your setup? Not necessarily made for a pump track, right? Yeah, on a pump track, you're supposed to coast and use the ramps to, you know, collect your speed. I'm pedaling the whole time, but I'm still using the ramps to collect more speed. But it's a fixed gear, so it's definitely different. What do you think about bike culture in NYC at the moment right now? It seems like it's blowing up bigger than ever, kind of. I mean, yeah, you got uh, rentable bikes, you got people really interested in bikes, cars pissed off. Um, I think it's great. I think extreme sports in general are exploding in New York City and all over the world right now. Thanks, Ed. Hell yeah.